Okay, people, stand by. That is our night you. Camera that rolling film and is the best action. film I see for action. the entire year. That is the best film I see. Action. You rolling? So, sorry, I got. I was watching the long line. Sorry. Train Begonians really love their movies. Hollywood and Bollywood are where the big box are in film. But don't you think it's time that TNT got in on the action? The local film industry is not as yet developed to the extent it could be, but I understand that the Ministry of Trade and Industry has big plans to shoot the local film sector, or as we jokingly say, the film sector, into stardom. Trinidad and Tobago is a natural star. Quite apart from being one of the most prosperous and industrialized countries in the region, we offer film crews the best of both worlds. A strategic tropical location with widely contrasting sites all in close proximity to one another, supported by well-developed, reliable infrastructure. A mere decade after Trinidad and Tobago's film sector began to emerge in the late 50s, local filmmakers had produced a small body of work, helped in part by the existence of a vibrant theatre community and experienced production crews. Plus, there were stories to tell. Before the advent of cable and satellite television, local broadcast was the most popular medium through which to get production seen by a mass audience, and local producers birthed many noteworthy series, including Gael, the Turn of the Tide, and Sugarcane Arrows. Our country's most recent soap opera, Westwood Park, has also had tremendous success overseas. Westwood Park went on for six seasons, mainly because I had met with someone from Paramount Pictures in, in London, and they looked at the first season, a couple episodes of the first season, and, and encouraged me to do more, because he said, you know, it could go a long way, but nobody's gonna buy one season, or nobody's gonna syndicate one season, so you need to have a body of work. Now, thanks to the Trinidad and Tobago Film Company, we've been able to put at least the first season on DVD because I could guarantee you that without their help, we would never have gotten that far. These successes have spurred the growth of the local film industry to the point where there are now as many as 11 production houses, 33 companies offering production support services, and six television stations, all providing employment for a core staff of more than 700. Trinidad and Tobago is also a popular location for foreign film crews, which generate annual revenues of over 7 million TT dollars. Opportunities for investment in the local film sector include the development of a sound stage, which will provide state-of-the-art facilities for the production of feature films, commercials, documentaries, and television shows, and a laboratory to process film. The Ministry of Trade and Industry has helped introduce incentives to make film more attractive to potential investors, including tax exemptions up to seven years on profits from the production of international feature films that promote Trinidad and Tobago, up to a million TT dollars in tax rebates for local productions that educate, entertain, or reflect local culture, and full exemption from custom duties on imports of equipment and raw materials in the tourism sector. There is also excellent institutional support from the Trinidad and Tobago Film Company, the statutory body set up to implement the industry strategic plan, and which, among other things, acts as a liaison for filming permission, working in conjunction with key agencies such as Customs and Excise and COT. The Trinidad and Tobago Film Company got started in January of 2006. It's a state agency, 100% financed by and through the Ministry of Trade, through the government of Trinidad and Tobago, its objective to establish Trinidad and Tobago as a premier production centre. We have two projects. One is called the Production Assistance and Script Development Programme that has funded to date 50 projects and there are a few notable successes. I'm not sure if you know of JAB, Sister God, the vegetarian super machine. This is the work that is coming from Trinidad and Tobago Nationals. Also, there is a feature film program. The feature film program is an equity investment. We really want to grow the number of feature films that are coming out of Trinidad and Tobago. We want to also encourage more people to invest in the industry of film. So there is a new measure and incentive which is offering people the incentive of creating more films in Trinidad and getting a rebate. There are 234 crews that have moved into Trinidad and Tobago since 99 that we have been able to actually register and in the overall there have been about 30, I think 30 million in expenditure in that period. Hmm, very impressive. But what about me? I mean, other than wanting to see local films, 
I have no connection with the film industry. So what benefits are there for the average Trimbegonian? Hmm? Film is a distillation of so many skills across so many different um, professions and so on. So in the course of making a movie, for instance, you've got your cast, of course, actors, you've got your technical people in the crew, your director of photography, your cinematographer, your production assistants, um, editors, sound, um, etc. That's the core. And that's just the core of it because you can branch out to ancillary um, services like catering and transport, um, legal, agency fees, publicity, um, interpretation and translation when you want to do subtitles um, in various languages, etc., etc. So there's tremendous potential for um, employment, income generation. A vibrant film and digital media industry is obviously significant to our country's economic and cultural development, providing meaningful employment and perhaps even more importantly, being an agent of change, an engine of nation building and a reflection of who we really are as Trinbegonians. Film will take these images to the world and help Trinidad and Tobago become more recognized, more competitive in a rapidly changing global economy. And if that doesn't deserve a standing ovation, I don't know what does. TNT is ready for its close-up. Okay, cut. How was that? That, that? that was what you were looking for? That's a wrap, people.